Well, I'm delighted to be joined here at Elfshire Europe 2019 by Patrick Pujeni, the CEO and Chairman of Total, who's just come and joined us. Thank you very much from the, the opening plenary session. Uh, there were a number of points that we could discuss if we had a, a whole lot of time. Sadly, we don't. But I was interested to hear you say, balanced against the energy transition that we know the industry must make, that there is still a need to invest in oil. Of course, you know, uh, the world needs uh, reliable, uh, affordable and clean energy. And today, the energy mix in the world is 80% uh, fundamentally of oil, gas and coal. So oil uh, is fundamental, you know, and uh, there are many people around the world who don't have access to energy. And uh, more than one billion people. We need to give this energy. So that's true that oil uh, is challenged because it's a source of CO2 emissions and the climate challenge is really for future fundamental. Uh, but before oil, we should tackle with coal, by the way, you know, and uh, which is first uh, because coal is emitting a lot more CO2 than oil and gas. So yes, we must continue to invest in oil, but in the same way, we, uh, we see projections for, for demand for oil, which could lower in 20, by 2040. So for a company like Total, it means that we focus on investing of one I, what I call low-cost oil, which means oil which will be sustainable on the long term with a price which is volatile, which could decline. And how do you continue to invest in oil against the backdrop of a low carbon future? But again, for a company, we are not Saudi Aramco, I'm not Saudi Arabia. I don't have 80 years or 100 years of reserve oil. I have more or less 20 years. So there is no, no matter, I have no doubt that in 20 years we will still continue to drive uh, vehicles we're using petroleum products even if we see a drive to electric power vehicles but if this is true in western countries this is true mainly in china it's not true all over the world and we need to give access to energy to everybody so on this 20 years framework i, I don't have any doubts uh, but again then it's a matter of preparing the future of the company. And in terms of allocation of investments today, when you look to the way we spread our investments, Total invests more or less, let's say, 15, 17 billion dollars per year. We invest more today in natural gas than in oil. And we also invest in low carbon power because we want to prepare the future. And we invest 1.5 to 2 billion dollars in low carbon electricity either from renewables or from natural gas. This is new to Total, but we built the company for the future. So, but today, if I want to be involved, invest in these low carbon businesses, I need to extract the cash from the oil business. There is no way, you don't create, you don't create cash by magic, you know? So I'm investing in oil to, be con to continue to benefit from these cash flows and we invest part of it in low carbon businesses. Sir, I wish I had longer to talk to you, but uh, thank you very much for spending some time here at OATV and I wish you all the very best for the rest of Offshore Europe 2019. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you.